Hello, welcome back to Seopolis. Last time we did some exploration, but it's time to get back on the quest grind. We uh, we finished information starting up and now we're moving on to wooden tech, t storage drawers and tinkers. Actually, I think for wooden tech, yeah, we just need leather, which hopefully while we did all of our adventuring last episode, we got enough leather gathered up inside of our bins here. Did we? There's four there. Oh yeah, oh, oh yeah, oh yeah, sure you betcha. And with that, we can grab our wool and make our bedroll and complete that quest. How was that done though? Yoink, bedroll. Nice, off to a good start. And we'll just put that away to never be used again. And look back at our quests. So now we've completed this one. So storage drawers. There's not a whole lot in here, so I think this one probably should go by pretty quick, right? Stores a large amount of one item. Click to view, uh-huh, uh-huh. All sorts of different storage drawers here. It looks pretty easy to make. I just need a chest and some planks, which we should have plenty of planks, right? Yeah, we have plenty of planks. A two item drawer, four item drawer, and a trim. Well, first let's go ahead and Turn these, get those there. We're probably gonna need a bunch of chests if it's gonna have us do all those things, so. We'll just turn them all into planks. There we go. And that should be a storage drawer, done. That mo makes the trim, which how do you make the trim? Okay, easy enough. Yeah, we're gonna mow through this one. Trim, done. Two item drawer, easy. I already made extra planks or extra chests because I knew you'd do this to me. I know your silly games. I'm not gonna play your reindeer games. Done. Four item drawer, four chests. Is that what you're gonna take from me, huh? Yeah, how, how could I have possibly have guessed such a thing? Done. All the chests, all the storage drawers, they're all mine. And that just leaves this one, framed drawers. Framed drawers can be used to give drawers a custom texture. This is done by a crafting table as shown. Interesting, well, I guess we're completely done with this one. Nice, all done with there. I should probably use these drawers too, right? Probably. I've never actually used storage drawers, but I imagine they'd probably be pretty handy. What if I just like put them up here or something? Um, sure. Well, I guess now we have drawers. Um, can I just put stuff in the drawers? I can. Hold on, how do I take it back? Give it back. I don't know what I should put in them. I don't have like an abundance of a specific resource, I don't think, but if slash when I do, I guess that'll be a good spot to put them. But that means we can move on to tinkers, which we've already got pretty much entirely done. All we need to do is make a stone pickaxe head, which should be pretty easy, right? I don't see why that would be a problem. Uh, put that there, make a stone pickaxe head, done. Easy, mowing through these babies. That just leaves CC1, which is a variety of things here. More dirt, making lots of dirt is useful. It wants me to make 64, more patterns, 32 patterns. 64 wood, a bunch of different logs. It wants all the logs. Mob drops, I need spider eyes. Wait, you can craft a spider eye? Spider essence. Uh, I don't have a way of getting spider eyes unless these give me spider eyes. Didn't these have like a small chance of giving? I thought I got a spider eye at one point. Did I not? I guess not. Fish, we need tropical fish. And then a compressed stone hammer, which should be pretty easy to make. So we need tropical fish. We'll just use this, get the bait back out, uh, grab our other wormies, our little, our little wormy boys. We have a bunch more. Turn those into bait as well. Start getting more fish fishing up out of our bins. So we'll take that out, put this in there, bam. Then I imagine that'll probably give us tropical fish and maybe even spider eyes? I don't know. <sighs> Meanwhile, I'm gonna have to go through the tedious process of shearing all these trees, turning them into getting logs and just grinding just a bunch of materials so I can complete this C12 quest thing. CC1. Luckily it has the auto destroy feature, so that's really helpful. Well, I've been chopping trees for a while now, and so far I, I made a bunch of stone hammers so I can make the compressed stone hammer thing too. So just knock that out of the park real quick, done. Next, to catch all up on the things that I've done so far too, I got the dirt, I got the stone, which is what we just made the hammers out of, I got the patterns, and for the woods, I've gotten three of the six so far, and I'm working on the acacia right now. Can I even grow dark oak logs in here? I'm not sure that I can. But the tropical fish, I'm not sure that we can even get tropical fish in here. Doesn't it need to be a jungle biome? 
I haven't gotten any tropical fish so far, but I'm also out of bait, which is a problem. I've gotten all my woods in like their own individual chests here now, so there's actually quite a lot of wood in here. Yoink. Worms? Did it give me worms? It did give me worms. Very good. And back to chopping trees. I have four of the six trees, but I don't think the other two are gonna fit in here. So here's what we're gonna do. We're gonna take some of these, we're gonna come up here, and we're gonna do a little thing. We're gonna do a little, you know, a little baby thing. Um, what's the strategy here? I'm gonna cut down a hole right here. We're gonna come out this way. And then I'll just, oh, my dirt, no! My precious dirt. Okay, this is fine. It's fine, stop freaking out. Hey buddy. What are you doing? Oh, what are you doing here? Go on, get. We don't want you. Nobody loves you. Oh my god. Squid hat. Hey, buddy. Um, everybody just needs to calm down here. I've got my jungle seeds. Let's do jungle first. At least it should be pretty easy to get 64 of these, right? Right? Uh, yep, that's a jungle tree. All right. Ooh, oh no, no. Oh god. That's fine. I'll just go up here and oh no, oh no the, t the air is toxic. I forgot about the uh, the toxic air thing. Um, it's because my axe broke. Huh. You don't love to see it. I'm gonna make an iron axe here. This one should be sh at least strong enough to be able to take down these bigger trees. How am I gonna get the rest of that tree up now? Can I just plant another tree underneath it? I'll die. I don't want to die. Okay, we just need to get high enough to be able to place a little bit of log underneath it. Let me get my health regenerated. I didn't know there was a bone structure over there. Look at that. Bread, come here. We're gonna do a risky thing here, all in the name of tree. You ready? Let's go, 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 go. Yeah, uh, uh, ow. Ooh. Uh, 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 ooh. Ooh, my body, it hurts, but it's fine, because I'm fine. Okay, now are you going to destroy the whole thing? Yes! Hey... Is there a wood in there somewhere? Oh... Uh, we're, I'm missing a lot of logs here. Where's all my logs? There you are. Well, at least we completed the jungle log one. And we have enough saplings to get another one if we really wanted to. I don't love the floating green structure right there, but what's a boy to do? <sighs> Nothing, that's what. Did I grab, yes, my dark oak here. And then grow, do it. Avada Kedabra, a booty kadubi, a blah 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 blah. Wait, let me eat. I'm gonna suffocate inside of this tree if I don't. A chubby doobie? Come on, tree. Come on, is it, is it because of that? Is that keeping you from growing? You're being a jerk, tree. All right, fine. We're gonna come over here. We're gonna fix it, okay? We'll fix it. Hey, buddy. You don't need to be here. Everything is slowly swimming towards me. Oh, there you are. You did it. Good job. I believed in you the entire time. Down, down you go. Yoink. What are you wearing? A little hat? A little cap? How much wood was that? Um, 46 logs? Not bad. That's probably gonna be the most efficient way to get wood, is just by taking these down. And done! That is mission accomplished on the tree scene. I'm even gonna need a door here. Ah, future me problem. I don't need a door there urgently. I'll just get a normal... Oak put back right there. We will put dark oak right there. Jungle right there. Bada bing! Bada boom. Now we just need spider eye, which we don't have, and the tropical fish. We could maybe get the spider eye if we find a spider. Hmm. We potentially do know where spiders are. I'm just saying. I'm gonna leave it there right now and, and wait on the spider scene. Just because I want to get more armored up before we actually go taking on more monsters. Okay, questing book. What else do you have? Moving on up, teching it up. We have a little bit of this complete. We need smooth stone. Um, we can make the stone barrel. That goes to gravel, flint, flint mesh, dust, dust, and clay. Ooh, clay. That's right. You put dust inside of a barrel, you get clay. That's how you get the grout. Smooth stone needs compressed smooth stone, or I could just burn some stony stone. Yoink, 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 yoink. Burn, burn it all. What? We got a tropical fish out of here. 
Bam! That means we just need the spider eye. Who didn't thunk it? I never knew. Now we have smooth stone, which is that how you make the stone barrel is with st smooth stone? It is, so we're gonna need more smooth stone. And then gravel. Breaking smooth stone with a hammer will make gravel. Okay, noted. So this, broken with this, gonna give me the gravel. Yes, it do. You write, you write. When you write, you write. What can I say? And then dropping from a sieve gravel is the string match. Blah, 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 blah. Gives you flint. And we've come full circle. Flint, tiny coal. Oh, hello. We'll just replace you in there real quick. And then a flint mesh is the next thing. Okay, so compressed flint, which is made with a bunch of flint. Four string meshes and a bunch of, so uh, just a butt ton of flint, really. Um, and I actually have several more gravels that I got from underground. I don't even need to make more stone. <laughs> I'm way ahead of the curb. Uh, you didn't even understand the power that you were dealing with here. I don't want to do all my gravel, though, because I probably will need it for other reasons, but... We need this, and actually we need, hold on, hold on. Yeah, we have the perfect amount right here. So we can just make the string mesh, which is made with vines. Yoink, 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 yoink. Boink, 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 boink. I actually need more vines. That just means we need to create another shears. Take, yoink, easy peasy. And then we just stick these things in here, like so. This in here, like yo. And then this in the center. And I got it backwards. Flint mesh! Nice! What other kind of meshes are there? What kind of meshes are you gonna make me make? An iron mesh, which is made... Oh, you have to cast an iron mesh with a flint mesh. That's not gonna be too big of a problem. Come, break, break! It's time you upgrade. You are a better mesh now. I don't know what all flint mesh can give me, but... You'll do good. I believe in you. Have you finished? Uh, have you... I need more. What did I get? Appetite. Is that from the flint gravel? What is appetite? Appetite, molten appetite. What do you do with it though? Photo grow, what? Crusher, lots of things apparently. Okay, now it's enough for the barrel. Yes. This can go right on this side. And then can't you put like a bunch of stones inside the barrel to make it turn into lava? Let's see, what else do we have here? Dust, dropping from sieving gravel and string mesh. Okay, so, wait, did we actually get some dust? Oh, I, I guess we did. Perfect, and then dust, dust blocks are made from dust, which tracks, I guess. What are the chances I can just do that in this? No, can't do nothing. Oh, you just craft dust. You can just straight up craft it, no problem at all. And then this turns into clay somehow. Like, a barrel filled with water, then right-clicked with the dust block, will make a block of clay. So could I just turn this into clay? <gasps> clay. And then it's gonna fill up for me? Automatic water? Nice. Now we're gonna be able to make grout. I see where this is going. We're gonna need to expand our base. So that is another tree completely done. Did I throw something? I don't think so. And then ceramics. Oh, all kinds of ceramics and pottery, ceramic shears, look at us. Which I have a feeling is going to require a lot of clay. Uh, unfortunately means we have to burn a lot of our stone. Is this going to be enough? We'll just do that. So we need to make clay, clay done. Then we need to make porcelain clay, which is made with dust and clay. Which actually I think we can just do. Yoink, porcelain clay, done. And then porcelain clay is going to make a clay unfired bucket and an unfired crucible with a stone barrel. I'm gonna pick up the stone barrel because I don't think we actually gonna use it for anything. So I'm gonna get all this stuff down. We're gonna break you. Awesome. And now we need dust. Interesting that you use dust to make dust and then you make dust into clay, but you combine clay and dust and it gives you porcelain clay. I'm not sure how, the, how that works. <laughs> What does that give me? Sulfur dust? I guess. Sure. But we're gonna go ahead and turn those into a bunch more there. We're gonna need a bunch more porcelain clay. And then we can just use that into making a bucket? Yes. Actually, I saw that. I saw that. We actually need... We need some clay shears too, because I saw that. And then making a 
Yes, an unfired crucible, which is good. Take that out of there. Fire my crucible, because obviously, if you have something unfired, you fire it. Give me that back. We'll place this down over here with a torch underneath it. And that actually should be enough to, to give it some heat. If it functions how I think it functions. Questing book. What did I complete? What all did I complete? I need two shears. I need two shears? Why would I need two shears? All right, more stew stone, more breaking, more sifting, more combining. Let me guess, clay shears part. Clay shears part, it's gonna give me clay shears if I combine them, huh, 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 huh? How dare you not do what I tell you to do immediately when I tell you to do it. Ceramic shears is made with ceramic parts. Ceramic shears parts, what did I just make? Clay shears parts, oh, do I have to fire it? Do I have to burn them? I do. And that's how pottery works. You gotta fire your pottery. <sighs> now I bet we could take these and just combine them into ceramic shears. Bam. Done. Easy peasy lemon squeezy. And that tree's half done. We've done wooden tech storage, storage drawers, tinkers, most of CC1, teching, teching it up, and half of ceramics. But that's gonna have to wrap it up for this video right here. It's extending out a bit longer than I'd hoped it would. I hope y'all are enjoying the series so far. If you are, leave a like. But until then, my name is JT, and I'll see y'all in the next video.